Shelly Shush. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to this weekly grocery haul. So what I'm going to share with you guys is, like I said, a weekly haul for my family. I do grocery delivery for my local grocery store. If I can find the receipt somewhere in the bags, I will let you guys know exactly how much that I spent. This is a very typical what I would buy in a week. I meal plan every single week. You guys, if you're following me over on Instagram, you will see on Sundays, I like to post what my weekly meal plan was from the last week, from the previous week. So I will actually, right over here, or right over here, I will insert like a, a little shot of what the meal plan is for this week that goes with all of these groceries. So if you guys are ready, let's just get right into it. All right, so here is a once over of everything that I got for this week. We do tons of dairy in our house, which you will notice when I start going through everything. Okay, so first up is these Made Good Morning bars. I haven't tried these yet, but I'm looking for a bar that I can put on uh, Luna's breakfast plates for her. And Made Good is really good because they don't have any nuts in them and Luna is allergic to nuts. So we got some of the breakfast bars. We got some of their soft bake red velvet cookies. I haven't tried these either. I also have not tried these, but I am very into pretzels, so they're like pretzel crackers. And then these are a staple at our house. These are like mini garden crackers. Uh, Luna eats these a lot with her lunches. She also has been into olives recently, so I got a can, a small can of the black, so I got a small can of the sliced black olives that I can use on her lunches. I'm gonna make chili this week, so let's do some kidney beans. I ordered a small jar of these baby dill pickles and they gave me a huge jar, but that's okay. I need panko for a recipe. Got my cat some food. She recently decided she doesn't like the one that I've been buying her, so I'm going to try out these fancy feasts. Uh, jasmine rice is always a staple in our house as well. And then I've got fettuccine, egg noodles, and rigatoni, all for recipes this week. I got some PC marinara pasta sauce. This is my favorite pasta sauce. I also got some teriyaki sauce for a recipe. I got two beef broths and then two chicken broths. I always buy two when they're on sale and then I just keep them in my pantry. I got these mini carrot muffins because again, I'm always looking for stuff that's easy to put on a breakfast plate for her because the mornings are so crazy here. Um, I've got some plain Greek yogurt. We use this in place of sour cream for taco night and we do tacos at least once a week. Um, I got two things of black pepper just because I want to stock some away and they were two for four dollars which is really cheap for black pepper. I got some mini hummuses. Uh, they're like the little individual packs. My husband can pack these with his lunch and then we got a spinach dip and a big hummus for at home. My daughter drinks kefir. If you guys have seen any of my grocery hauls ever before, you will know she drinks kefir as like taking a bottle before she goes to bed. And my husband loves tortilla chips, so I actually haven't tried this kind before, but I got one of those. I ordered the very, very small milk because nobody in my house drinks cow's milk, but we use it for recipes. So I got a very small one, but they gave me the largest one they have. Okay, getting into dairy. I know this looks like a lot, but this is literally what we will go through in just one week. So we've got some shredded Parmesan, some shredded cheddar, cream cheese for a recipe. These are cheese portions, and I like these for lunches. Then we also did marble cheese slices. Luna has one of these yogurts every single morning with her breakfast. I did three of the Greek yogurts because these ones are my favorite and um, they were on sale for three for $10. So we got a coconut, we have banana, and the bottom one is strawberry banana. And I specifically buy these three because they're the only three of this brand that don't need to be stirred. I don't like the fruit on the bottom types. And then for some deli meat, we have some pepperoni sticks. We have hot dogs. Luna is on a hot dog kick right now, and these are the free ones. Sorry, these are the free from ones, which means that they don't have any fillers or anything. You can read all the ingredients are super clean. And then I got some summer sausage to have for my lunches. 
and then some smoked black forest ham for Luna's lunches. For meat, I did three ground beefs. I don't think I need all three of them this week, but I definitely need two of them. And I think I just got one extra to start me off on next week. And then we did some ground turkey. I also got some breakfast sausages and then some pork sausages that I will open up and use the, the ground meat from inside for a recipe. Moving on to our produce. I hate it when I order groceries on a Sunday and they give me green bananas. What is a mother supposed to do with a bunch of green bananas on a Sunday for the week? It's ridiculous to me. Uh, but moving on, um, some sugar snap peas for my lunches, some carrots for my lunches. I ordered two nectarines. They are the tiniest nectarines I've ever seen in my entire life, but we'll make them work. I got some Easy Peel Mandarins. Um, I plan on making chili this week again, so I'm going to need some celery. I got garlic. Green onions are a staple for us. Luna asked for pineapple this week, so I ended up getting this one. It was a dollar more than getting like a whole pineapple, but just to save myself the frustration of having to peel a pineapple and figuring out when it's ripe enough to peel, I decided to just go with the more expensive choice. And then over here, if you guys have not tried this before, it is fantastic. Dill pickle chopped salad, and I will have this for lunch one day. And then we also got a bunch of grapes. As you can see on the bottom here, they are not good. And I'm pretty sure they were expensive. So I will be taking those back, and I am not happy about getting those at all. Um, I needed some baby wipes. We buy the big boxes that are like the refill types and then we just reuse the package. But I like to have these ones in the pre-packaged ones out in my living room because I use them when the kids are finished eating and I always wanna have one by the dining table, by the coffee table, just everywhere. And then I ran out of dish soap and I wanted to try this one. It says that it's 98% natural. I'm wondering what the other 2% is, but I went with this one. And then just a couple more items over on this side. I got some riced broccoli and zucchini. And uh, oh, I didn't realize it had kale, but that's really good. I wanna try giving this to Maverick this week and I will also use it in a recipe. This is frozen. And then I also did corn and jalapenos. This is gonna be for, um, for our chili, but also I eat this just on its own. And then they didn't have the baby oatmeal, so they gave me baby rice instead, which is fine. And then uh, this was a substitution for something that I had ordered, but when they called me to ask if the substitutions were okay, I told them I don't want the English muffins, and then they gave me two sets of English muffins. So I love that for us. All right, so all together, I spent $297. I also got um, almost 13,000 points. The point system at my grocery store is actually really, really good. And so $13 back, just kind of, I bank all of them. And then anytime we have a special occasion where I'll have lots of people coming over for dinner or a birthday party or something like that, then I'll spend my points. So it's not like I'm, I'm taking money out of my pocket to, to do these big things that I usually do. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I hope I gave you some inspiration for some meals that you can use for your family this week. Please subscribe to my channel if you are new around here. You can follow me over on Instagram at mrs.shelly.shoosh and I will catch up with you soon in a new video. Bye!